Mary Murdoch was born in Elgin in Scotland in 1864. After she finished school, she cared for her mother until she died in 1887. But during this time, Mary discovered her one true love, and that was medicine. She graduated as a doctor in 1892, but in 1893, Mary arrived here in Hull. She became the house surgeon at the Victoria Hospital for sick children. But in 1896, Mary became a GP. This was Hull's first female GP. Mary was a really kind doctor and listened to what her patients needed. She encouraged young mothers to go out and get an education and for fathers to have a more hands-on approach to caring for their children. Mary was also heavily involved in the suffragette movement. She founded the Hull Women's Suffrage Society in 1904 and this is something that she passionately campaigned for throughout her entire life, even giving talks on the subject all around the world in places like Canada, Sweden and Rome. But it wasn't all work for Mary. Mary was the first woman in Hull to own a car and she was really well known for driving this car all around the city at really high speeds. In 1916, Mary went out into the snow to care for a patient, but unfortunately she herself fell unwell and died. Thousands of people attended a funeral and the funeral procession was led by her car. Right until the very end, Mary was dedicated to caring for her patients, to caring for Hull, and it is without a doubt thanks to people like Dr Mary Murdoch that Hull was able to grow and evolve and become what it is today.